Okay, so this is what I did. Um, we're looking at a, a table here, a list of data where we have multiple names and we're going to want to do this. We want to change this around where reports are at the top and so then we can have Abraham Lincoln stuff all listed going across. So what I did was I selected my data. I went to data pivot table. It opened up my sheet. I told it which rows to add. I want to add name as my rows. I don't need to see the totals. And then it asked me to change to my columns. I want those to be reports. And I don't need to see totals for that either. And then values, the values that I wanted to go across were scores. And it has some as default, but if you're not showing the totals, that's not going to matter anyway. And that's how I made the pivot table. So now I have spread that out a little bit. Now I can come in here and use AutoCrack on these folks. So I would suggest that if you had back here, you also had a file. Let's do this. Insert one to the left and call this email address. And you had all kinds of, I'm just going to put some stuff in there for right now as random for random email addresses. If those were the email addresses, you should be able to come over to your pivot table and also add email addresses as a row. So now you have, and I still don't need to see totals. So now I have the email address that can be in line so I can use it all in AutoCraft.